In this video, we will get to learn about introduction to determinants, minors, cofactors, adjoint of a matrix, the value associated with a square matrix is termed determinant. For example, if A is a matrix with elements A is equal to A, B, C, D, then its determinant counterpart will be determinant of matrix A is equal to determinant of elements A, B, C, D, which is again equal to AD minus CB. Mr. Mayank Maheshwari from Puran Chandra Vidya Niketan Kanpur will tell us more about this topic. We know that a matrix is simply a representation of numbers in the form of arrays and it has got no value as such. However, we associate a number or expression with a square matrix, say A, denoted by determined value of A. Now, to evaluate the determined value of a matrix, we begin with a matrix of order 1 cross 1, say matrix A, which is equal to 5. There is just one element in this matrix and its determined value is nothing but 5 only. Similarly, for a matrix of order 2 cross 2, say A is equal to 2, 4, 1, 8, its determinant value is given by 2 into 8 minus 1 into 4, that is 16 minus 4, that is 14. In general, we can call it as matrix A if given by A11, A12, A21, A22, then its determinant value is A11 into A22 minus A21 into A12. So, finding the determinant value of a 1 cross 1 matrix and a 2 cross 2 matrix is very simple. Now, we will proceed to find the determinant value of a 3 cross 3 matrix. Before that, we need to study what is minor and cofactor. To find the minor of a matrix of or of a, to find the minor of a square matrix, of order n, we need to find the determinant value of a sub matrix, rather sub square matrix of order n minus 1. In other words, if we have a matrix A of order 2 by 2 denoted by A11, A12, A21, A22, then the minor of the element A11 represented by M11 is given by A22. Similarly, minor of of A21 denoted by M21 is nothing but delete the row and the column going through it and we are left with A12. This is the way we can find the minor of a matrix of order 2 cross 2. Similarly, for a matrix of order 3 cross 3, denoted by A11, A12, A13, A21, A22, A23, A31, A32, A33. The minor of any element, say A21, denoted by M21, is obtained by deleting a row and a column passing through it and finding the determinant value of the leftover square matrix which is given by over here A22, A33 minus A32, A23. This is a way we can find the minor of all the nine elements of this matrix. Now we switch over to cofactor because minor is as such not very important. We switch over to cofactor. Cofactor of any element say Aij represented by Cij is nothing but minus 1 to the power i plus j into mij, which means we simply add a sign of plus or minus from our side with the minor of that element. Now, suppose we want to find the cofactor of element 1 comma 1, a 1 1. Now, over here i is 1, j is 1, so i plus j is 2 and minus 1 square 
being an even power is plus 1. So C11 is nothing but M11. But for element A12, the cofactor of it is represented by C12 and it becomes minus 1 to the power 3 M12, which is minus of M12. So a sign of plus or minus is inserted with the minor of that element. The sign convention is brief for a 2 cross matrix becomes 2 cross 2 matrix becomes plus minus minus plus. However, for a 3 cross matrix it is plus minus plus minus plus minus plus minus plus. In the diagonal we see plus over there. So these are the signs which are inserted with the minors of the element. Now having understood this concept of cofactor, let us find the cofactor of one or two element of a 3 cross 3 matrix so that we can find the determinant value later on. Suppose A is a square matrix of order 3 cross 3 whose elements are given by 208, minus 165, 7, 2 and 5. Suppose we want to find the minor of element 7 which over here which is actually C31. It is given by minus 1 to the power 3 plus 1 and minor of 3 1. Minus 1 to the power 4 is positive, so it is simply M31 which is obtained by deleting one row and one column going through it. So this comes out to be minus 48. Similarly, we can find a cofactor of any of the element of this matrix. Now we define determinant value of a 3 cross 3 matrix. To find the determinant value of a 3 cross 3 matrix, we pick up any row or any column and then multiply its elements by their respective cofactors and then finally add it. For example, suppose we pick up the first row whose elements over here are 208 and in, uh, in standard notation they are A11, A12 and A13. So the determinant value will be given by A11, C11 plus A12, C12 plus A13, C13. In particular, for this case, if we want to find the determinant value, it will be A11 which is 2 and the cofactor of it. Now it being 1, 1, so we will be using the plus sign. First row and first column is deleted, 6, 2, 5, 5. Then you come to A12 which is basically 0 and cofactor of it which will be with a minus sign and we delete one row and column going to it minus 1, 7, 5, 5. As I told you we will be having a minus sign over here and finally for A13 which is 8 and its cofactor will be in with our side, we will be having a plus sign only, minus 1, 7, 6, 2. Now, if you open it, 6, 5 is 30, minus 10 is 20, 22 is 40. This is 0 only. This is minus 2, minus 42, which is minus 44. So, 8 multiplied with 44. So, this comes out to be minus 3, 1, 2. So, we see that a determinant value can be positive, it can be negative and it can be 0 as well. Now let us discuss determinant value in detail. Some important features of determinant value is determinant value of a joint A is nothing but determinant value of A to the power n minus 1 where n is the order of matrix. That means if matrix A is order of order 3 cross 3 and suppose its determinant value is 10, then the determinant value of its adjoint will be given by 10 to the power 2 which is 100. Similarly, determinant value of the inverse of matrix A is given by 1 upon determinant value of A and in this particular case it will be 1 upon 10. Also, the determinant value of A transpose is same as determinant value of A. And determinant value of the product of two matrices is the determinant value of the 
matrix A multiplied with determinant value of matrix B. Minor of an element A i j of a determinant is the determinant obtained by deleting its ith row and jth column in which element A i j lies. Minor of an element A i j is denoted by M i j. Cofactor of an element A i j denoted by C i j is defined by C i j is equal to minus 1 raised to i plus j into M i j where M i j is minor of A i j. The adjoint of square matrix A is equal to A i j n cross n is defined as the transpose of the matrix. C i j n cross n where C i j is the cofactor of the element A i j adjoint of the matrix A is denoted by adjoint of A. For more such videos, log on to CBSE section of jagranjosh.com.